As a young crow, Harold T. Crow had been traveling a long way to get home. He became very tired and decided to rest. So, he flew to a willow tree to rest. While resting, he noticed that there was a pitcher filled with water on the ground under the tree. Needing to quench his thirst, Harold flew down from the tree to drink the water. He sat on the brim of the pitcher and tried to put his beak inside. He soon found out that his beak was too large and could not fit inside of the narrow neck of the pitcher. Harold then proceeded to try and knock the pitcher over, but it was too heavy. Harold said he soon grew tired and became very frustrated from trying to get the water inside of the pitcher. Feeling defeated, he flew back to the tree and began to cry. I'm so thirsty, I can't grow. What am I to do? I have tried most everything and my work's not through. Harold said to me that under any other circumstances, he would have given up and flown away. But he was so thirsty that he couldn't let it go. He said to himself, I know this is hard, but I can do it. He began to think of different ways to get the water inside of the pitcher. Looking down from the tree at the pitcher, he noticed that there were several tiny pebbles on the ground. An idea came to him on how he would be able to drink the water. One by one, I'll drop the pebbles. Soon the water will we'll reach the brim. I'll have enough water to drink. Life is not so With that thought in mind, Harold said he flew back to the pitcher and began dropping the pebbles inside of the pitcher. With each pebble he dropped, the water began to rise higher. Finally, after several minutes of working steadily, the water reached the brim of the pitcher. Harold drank until he was no longer thirsty and then flew away. Never give up on what you want. You can always get it done. 